Hi everyone. Our project for today is to get rid of the skunk that moved into my house over the summer. He climbed in through a hole uh, in the side of the house. We filled the hole one time with concrete and patched it from the inside and the little stinker dug around through his original hole and around the concrete that was in the under the house. I have a couple of traps in the barn but if I trap this guy I don't really have any place or any way to get rid of him or take him miles away from the house um, without putting him in a vehicle and I'm not about to do that. So this stinky guy has climbed in through my house digging a hole right there and it goes in through the house. He's actually burrowed some around the house, but he goes in through the bottom of the house and into the hole on the inside. That's a close-up of the hole. This is where the hole was. So while I'm in here, I'm going to add some mesh to that hole and then fill it with concrete. That little stinker? Gross. So this is what we're going to use for our project here. We're going to mix up some quickcrete in the wheelbarrow so we can roll it in there. And this is the mesh that I'm going to use and put down into the skunk barrow. Just a minute, baby. down in there, so it's a teeny tiny hole. Yeah. Oh, you gotta be quiet. Yeah, we don't want the skull coming out here. There he goes. Sorry, Mommy. Yeah, are you trying to sword me in the face? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to kill, kill the kill, okay. kill the skunk. You're trying to kill the skunk? Yeah. Now I'm going to have my handy helper get this plastic tub here and fill it with water. Mommy, I got your leg. Don't get my leg. I got it. Ah ha ha ha. Pour the rest of it into the middle, okay? Yeah. Right there in that hole. Good job, thank you. Yep. What do I add? Go fill it up. Mm, nope. Can can you fill it up? Yep. She put it in there. This is all the stuff that I shoveled over at last time. He just came right back in and dug it all back out. Yes, please. Okay, we're gonna take this inside. How about this? How about the car? The car doesn't need to go in there. Yeah. Oh, it stinks in there. I hope he's not in there. That would be so Oh, bad. I just got a wh whiff of something. I'm scared. <laughs> Sticking my knees in his poop, too, I think. I think I'm stuck up here. I think he's in there. That stinks. I'm scared. Oh. Oh. I don't see anything. Oh. Why would you tell me that? Dude, he's in there. Is he in there? 
If he comes out, it's every man for himself. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's in there. Oh, why would you do that? He's going to have to dig his way out. No, he's going to die. No, he's not going to die. He's going to dig his way out. No, he's not, because you had that stuff. I'm going to come see his gut. You can't see it. You can only smell it. Okay, so I'm going to put the wheelbarrow, I'm going to move these chairs, I'm going to put the wheelbarrow right here like I did before, okay. and shovel up. Okay. All right. Oh, I can, he is stinky. He is stinky and he is in there. Mommy, just get a clothespin and put it on your nose. Boom, problem yeah. solved. Problem solved, you're right. Oh, he's in there. FYI, it stinks. Well, it's four days post skunk eviction, and I think we have a win. I've been checking the past couple of days inside and outside of the house to see if we trapped the skunk inside or if he managed to dig his way out and I haven't seen a sign of him one way or the other. This is the outside of the repair. It was right there was the hole on the outside. So we're going back in. Hopefully he's not going to jump out and scare me if we did trap him in and he dug out. <laughs> this is my patch job here. It doesn't look like the skunk has dug his way around it. Still sealed pretty tight. I didn't really explain my motivation for adding the mesh screen or even burying the poop into the original hole. My thought was I've heard that um, Dogs don't like to dig through chicken wire. If you've got a spot where they're digging to bury t chicken wire, I thought that mesh was a great solution. And um, dogs also, I know when my dogs would dig holes, I would just bury their poop in it and it seemed to solve the problem. So that's why I stuffed the skunk poop in the video back down the hole where he came from. Hopefully we've got a win here and uh, he's been evicted. Yay for no more skunk. <laughs>